Hello, welcome to the CEO DG and La YouTube channel. Are you ready to face today's five interesting general knowledge question answers for 27th March 2022? Here I am going to start today's Amazon quiz questions. Here you can see the main page of Amazon from there to I am opening fun zone where we find the daily quiz questions. Here fun zone page is opened, win prizes every day and searching for today's quiz questions here. Here it is. Quiz time answer and winner exciting prizes every day. Now I am going to start by clicking on play now button. Daily quiz time answer all 5 questions. Enter the lucky draw to win the prize by answering all 5 questions correctly. If all 5 quiz questions answers correct then only there is a chance of entering the lucky draw and also a chance to win Amazon pay rupees that is 1000 rupees. Now I am going to start by clicking on start button. Here you can see the first uh, interesting question from amazon tupolev tu 160m the russian made strategic missile bomber is nicknamed what repeating the question tupolev tu 160m the russian made strategic missile bomber is nicknamed what here the options are grey wolf brown bear white swan Wolverine, which one you are guessing? Like this, whenever you see the remaining questions with uh, options, uh, if possible, note down your guess answers on a piece of paper and after completion of the quiz, uh, check yourself how many your guess answers were right and how many were uh, wrong. Like that, you can test your learning skills by watching this video along with the extra information which I provide each and every video. So, without any further ado, I am going to add some more info. The Tupolev Tu-160, literally it is called White Swan, NATO reporting name Black Jack, actually NATO reporting name is Black Jack, it is a, a supersonic variable sweep wing heavy strategic bomber designed by the Tupolev Design Bureau in the Soviet Union in the 1917s. in the 1970s it is uh, the largest and heaviest uh, mac 2 plus uh, supersonic uh, military aircraft uh, ever built and second to the experimental xb70 valkyrie in overall length as of 2022 it is uh, the largest and heaviest uh, combat aircraft the fastest bomber in use and the largest and heaviest variable sweep wing airplane ever flown so as per the question the correct option is the third one that is a white swan tupolo 2 tu 160m the russian made strategic missile bomber is nicknamed as white swan so i am clicking on third option white swan So bang and came here, and moving to the second question. In two thousand twenty-two, Aisha A. Malik was sworn in as the first female judge of the Supreme Court in the history of which country? Very interesting question, and also fees through the GK laws, especially those who are uh, appearing for IAS like that. There some competitive exams. Uh, In 2022, Aisha A. Malik was sworn in as the first female judge of the Supreme Court in the history of each country. Here the options are Bangladesh, Qatar, Nepal, Pakistan. Which one you are guessing? I am adding some more info. Aisha A. Malik was born on 3rd June 1966 in Karachi, Sindh. She is a Pakistani judge. she is uh, the first female judge of the supreme court in the history of pakistan 
on 6th January 2022, the Judicial Commission of Pakistan approved her appointment to the Supreme Court of Pakistan. She took her oath of office on 24th January 2022. Malik has also served as a judge of the Lahore High Court in Pakistan from 27th March 2022 to 5th January 2022. So as per the question, the correct option is the fourth one that is Pakistan. In 2022, Aisha A. Malik was uh, sworn in uh, as a In 2022, Ayesha A. Malik was sworn in as the first female judge of the Supreme Court in the history of Pakistan country. So I'm clicking on third. Uh, I'm clicking on fourth option, Pakistan. So Bangan came here, and moving to the third question. Look at the image here. Who backed uh, the women's singles title at uh, the Sayyid Modi International Tournament uh, 2022? Repeating the question, who backed uh, the women's singles title at uh, the Sayyid Modi International Tournament 2022? Here the options are uh, Saina Nehwal, PV Sindhu, Amita Singh, Manasi Girish Chandra Joshi, whom are you guessing? I am adding some more info. Is Indian Shuttler P. V. Sindhu has backed the women's singles titles at the Sayyid Modi International Tournament in Lucknow. Sindhu beat fellow Indian Malavika Bansod 21-13, 21-16 to win her second Sayyid Modi title after 2017. The 2022 Sayyid Modi International Badminton Tournament was held at Babu Banarasi Das Indoor Stadium in Lucknow, Uttar Pradesh from 18 to 23 January 2022. So as per the question, the correct option is the second one that is PV Sindhu. P.V. Sindhu backed the women's singles title at the Sayyid Modi International Tournament in 2022. So I am clicking on second option, P.V. Sindhu. Thus, right came here. And moving to the fourth question. And also first image, look at the image. Subway printed there. This fast food restaurant franchise was uh, founded in uh, which country in uh, 1965? It is very lovely question. Repeating the question, this uh, fast food uh, restaurant franchise uh, was uh, founded in uh, which country in uh, 1965? So, here the options are uh, USA, UK, Germany, Italy. Which one you are guessing? Very interesting question this is. Uh, I am adding some more info. Subway is uh, an American multinational fast food restaurant franchise uh, that uh, primarily sells uh, submarine sandwiches, uh, wraps, uh, salads uh, and beverages. Uh, do you know who founded it? Uh, Subway was founded by 17-year-old Fred D. Luca. Fred D. Luca. F-R-E-D-D-E-L-U-C-A. Fred D. Luca and financed by Peter Buck in 1965 as Pete's Super Submarines in Bridgeport, Connecticut. The restaurant was renamed Subway two years later and a franchise operation began in 1974 with a second restaurant in Wallingford, Connecticut. Since then, it has expanded 
to become a global franchise do you know where is its uh, international headquarters located the head uh, international headquarters are located in uh, milford uh, canicut in uh, usa so as per the question the correct option is the uh, the first one that is uh, usa this uh, fast food restaurant uh, that is a uh, subway franchise was uh, founded in uh, USA country in 1965 so i am clicking on first option usa so bangan came here and uh, moving to the final question <coughs> and also second image uh, look at the image this is a visual from each country so how many members can you read this one and uh, in english also there is some uh, slogan can you read it the slogan is uh, many small people uh, who in many small places do many small things can alter the face of the world very interesting slogan this is uh, repeating the slogan many small people who in many small places do many small things can alter the face of the world this is a slogan in this image uh, and uh, where is it uh, or where can you find this one here the options are rome bonn berlin milan which one you are guessing i am adding some more info the east side gallery memorial the east side gallery memorial in berlin friedrich schan is a permanent open air gallery on the longest surviving section of the berlin wall in the spring of 1990 after the opening of the berlin wall this section was painted by 118 artists from 21 countries the artists commented on the political changes of 1989 to 1990 in a good 100 paintings on the side of the wall that was formerly facing east berlin So as per the question, the correct option is uh, the third one. That is uh, Berlin. This is a visual from Berlin city. So I'm clicking on third option, Berlin. Keep it up, came here. I think most of your guest answers correct. Here also five out of five quiz questions answers correct. As appreciation, well done, exhibited here, are displayed here. You are. Uh, eligible for a lucky draw in this contest amazon pay rupees uh, 1000 and those are interested they can check the winners list on 28th march 2022 keep learning enhance your interesting and uh, enormous dynamic skills dhanyawad thank you if you like this video do like subscribe and share see you in the next one bye bye